Om Banwa, that is good evening. I have uh, finally completed learning the, the song, so that's great. Uh, this song that I've been practicing is called Is It Just Me? So it's a, uh, yeah, it's a song sung by this girl called Emily Burns. So why I actually practice this song is because uh, my friend's birthday is coming up and I asked her what, uh, what music does she want to hear being played on the piano. So I'll try, so I wanted to try that. No, it's like, want to... Nice lah. I mean, it's nice to play something for a friend. So, so I chose, uh, she wanted this song. So I have spent the past week practicing this song. I think six days. So I'm quite happy with the progress. And uh, yes, so here it goes. Um... Them, uh, just some hiccups, but that is fine. So, yeah, so this is the song practiced and played as promised. Uh, yeah, so happy birthday! Um, yeah, happy birthday! Have a uh, have a good year, and uh, yeah. <laughs> um, so about this song, um, about my reflections on, on learning this song on piano. Um, melody is, is rather straightforward. Uh, chords are also straightforward after you get the hang of it. And also, uh, something I learned is, um, if you, okay, so, I used Sintonsia to see what chords are being played. And then I understand that they are playing inverted chords to make the movement of the hand easier. And also because, um, sometimes you need to do chord inversion so that the chord is the highest note of the chord doesn't exceed the note of the of the melody something like that i think men mentioned it before but i'm not exactly sure what uh so over here you see right i wrote down uh verse one the chords then pre-chorus chords then uh the pre-chorus chords because there's two parts of the pre-chorus then the chorus chords so this helps me to remember what chords have to be played. Sometimes when I'm doing the practice, then I'm like, I don't want to just go to look at YouTube again. I just look at the chords and I'm like, ah, it was this chord. So yeah. And uh, in terms of combining it all together, it was very fun. Uh, I think this round of, this song has really taught me about tempo and how tempo is created by the chords. Yeah. So one more time, let me do the chorus one more time because I think the chorus is really nice. So...
so if you actually um, listen to it very closely, the melody can have whatever pace it wants, but the chords follow the same. Ba, 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 ba. Yeah, and kind of like you build the melody ar of around the chord. So something very interesting, um, music right, is always made in, in fours, in like four beats. For example, um, I'll give you a very classic song. Ah, Viva, Viva La Vida, right? So it's... Yeah, so... Uh... Oh, no, okay, maybe not a good example. I, I, I'm, I, I can't break it down that easily. Um... Ah, okay, um... Faded. The starting part. So you can actually count. Four? Okay, wait. Whoa. Four. Then. Four. Then. So it's always in fours, which is very interesting. And I always like to count, especially the EDM songs, where you know exactly when the bass is gonna drop. Because you just need to count in multiples of four. Actually, multiples of eight also matters like, if you don't if you don't want to break it down into fours or eight. Yeah. So um yeah. Uh another another one is um clocks, right? Uh so it's one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Right, so it's so that's like four beats. How do I count? Yeah, it's like Ba 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 ma ba ma ba ma ba ba ma ma ba ma. So it's like four, right? And it's like you never notice, but it just, it's just perfect. Like four is perfect. Like three is too little, five is too much, or it's odd. But four is just perfect. So, no, that's maybe that's how music was invented or music was was discovered and just naturally feels good to us. So yeah, it's always in sets of four. How do I do that? Okay, so. You just listen to the tapping of my foot, cause I I can't I can't, I can't do yeah so so the foot I okay wait wait so I think if you listen again to that. Yeah, it is sets of four. Then it will change. So it's really very interesting. Or, or like uh, sun goes down. Um, by Lil Nas X. Um, Okay, you just count. I cannot count and do the. I cannot count and do the. 
I require a higher piano mind. So anyway, you, you count again, so it's... Okay, so let's do it again. So it's really in test of four, which is really honestly very interesting. Yeah. Um, so yeah, that's all for today. Uh, no pull-ups because I'm feeling the side effects of the booster pretty strongly. Uh, very like tired, lethargic. But that's fine. Uh, pull-ups will always be there. Focus on other things that I can do, which is like piano and learning some Japanese. So yeah, that's it. And once again, happy birthday. Have a have a good celebration.